Well, I have a beach house in Brigantine, New Jersey. We just moved there permanently, and I wanted to jazz it up. So what I did was I painted one of the bedrooms, and I wanted an accent wall that popped color oh. and did texture. So oh I boy. found out about That's rag a lot of color. <laughs> <laughs> I, uh, I found out about rag rolling, and I used four colors. However, I think four may have been a little bit too many. So my question is, how many colors would be ideal to use? Okay, well, first of all, Anne, come here. <laughs> we need to have a design intervention. Just come, come here. Can we do a little bit of an intervention? Come stand over here. And you're going to let her play with paint again? Yes. And I'm going to show you how to do it right. I'm just kidding. Okay. I'm just kidding. <laughs> now, listen, when you just asked me how many colors, yes. whatever number you had there is not the, the many colors. That, right, OK. We are going to use a few different colors, but they're going to be the same paint color, okay. but different tones. So we're going to start with a light a medium and a dark. Okay. And we are gonna give this wall a faux finish treatment that is perfect for a beach house. And I would like for you to go right home and tackle this project immediately, <laughs> immediately, okay. So first of all, we're gonna paint the, you know when you uh, see a paint deck, it has all the different tones? Yes. So we're gonna take one strip, that's all we're working with. We're gonna paint the base Oh, that's color. like guardrails, like 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 gutter, Keep like it, when, they, yeah. when kids play bowling and they put the gutter Exactly, guards it's in. like foolproof. You can't go wrong. So okay. stick with the same family. Exactly. Gotcha. And this also works for you if you're doing an entire house and you want to choose different colors. It'll look like a designer came and pulled it for you okay. if you're using different colors on that strip. Okay, so we're going to start with a base. And then next, I use some glaze. It's just decorative glaze. And you pour like one part of paint to four parts of glaze. All that's doing is kind of thinning it out a little bit so it's not as... Um, opaque as this. Okay, so we are going to just take the rag, which I know you love so much. <laughs> All right. And she's so excited, she's bouncing out of her skin. <laughs> instead of doing this, this is what you did with the rag, right? Oh, I did everything. <laughs> I rolled, I did it. We are going to it just getting worse. <laughs> yeah. We are going to just smooth this on oh, just okay. to and it's it almost is gonna disappear, but it's gonna give it texture, right? Okay. So you can keep layering it on. If you want it to be a little more color, you can add more paint to the glaze, but we're just gonna keep doing this to the surface. Okay? It's a lot more subtle. Yeah. yeah, now that's just step one. So next thing we're gonna do is I took an even darker shade and it'll also get darker as it dries. And what I'm gonna do with this dry brush is drop it in here and I'm just gonna give it this like streaky, Ooh. hold on, we're gonna get there. And it, you know, when you say faux finish, a lot of times what people are going for is that Tuscan feel like an uh -huh. old age right. wall. And that's what we're gonna do here is we're gonna give it this old That looks like age. weather, like it's really pretty. Yeah. It looks yeah. like, you know, mist or fog or something. It's really it pretty. Very See, it yeah. looks very beachy. It, it does. looks beachy yeah. and it also feels, thanks. It also feels like, um, like the water, whatever you can yeah. use, any color. And then if you want to give it more of an age look, just take a little bit of water and vinegar and spritz it on. And all of a sudden these little surface bubbles will start to create. Can you see oh, that wow. happening yes. right mm -hmm. there? Yeah. All right, can you handle it? <laughs> Try. Yeah, I did, I did. I, did. I thought that restaurant. was really cool, yeah. Tanya. Yeah. We just did a taqueria restaurant. Right. The whole thing I did it in three hours. Right there, Beautiful. you see that picture? Look at that. So you don't oh see all God. the walls there, but that little portion there. Did the entire restaurant in three hours. <laughs> Love all right, girl, you got this. So